Good morning, it's Liz. Sorry, remember today's Sunday, my day of uh, rest my face. So you get me in the all natural. So to this morning I got up early, well not early, I was up late drawing and designing. I came up with a mask design that um, nurses in the intensive care unit where I work want masks to cover their N95 masks just to try to help them last longer. So I was gonna initially use t-shirt material, but my fear is that um, people will think they're masks and they offer protection. T-shirt material is super thin and it is absolutely no protection. And if I put several layers, it'll be heavy. So I came up with, I'm gonna make masks that just simply they'll put over their N95s. They can take them off and put them into a bag that I'm gonna give them a cloth bag and then as they go through the day, that by the end of the day, their cloth bag will be full of these masks that can then be thrown in the washer and washed. I just want to mention something though. It's a shame. I thought of this idea to um, get people to use masks who are outside of the hospitals so that we can save our good masks for the hospitals, right? Because our employers and OSHA should be providing, making sure that in workers in the state of California and in the United States are safe and have the safety tools that they need to do their jobs. I know that I've paid over $30,000 to my union. And at this time, when I need my union most to fight for my rights and get me my paycheck or my disability check or my workers' comp check, that I haven't had in seven weeks, they're nowhere to be found. And now I know that my nursing friends who are in the intensive care unit don't even have to, have to recycle and use over and over or make equipment last for a whole week. Um, I just think it's a shame. If I've paid over $30,000 to my union who's not there to help me, I can imagine how much money all those CNA, all those nurses have paid to their union, and yet they're having to go through this. So today I'm on a mission to uh, make masks that aren't really masks. Well, they are masks. They can be used as masks outside of the hospital, but they're basically going to be a shield to try and help make their N95s last longer. All right. Let's see how this project goes. Let's see if the hospital even allows them to wear these in the hospital on top of their masks. Take care, everybody. I'm on a mission.